Hi everybody, we've got quite a few fun DIYs today for this New Year's Eve tablescape. Let's start off with this one from Dollar Tree. I used these silver mixing bowls from Dollar Tree and hot glued one on top of the other to make a nice display. Next, I used shredded foil from Dollar Tree and stuffed it inside a glass vase that I previously purchased from Dollar Tree. And I like that some of it is spilling out because it's giving me that fun, festive effect, almost like it's toppling over or bubbling out. Here, I have a large Christmas ornament that I thrifted for 99 cents. I spray painted it silver and sat it on top of the vase. To embellish the ornament and give it sort of a disco ball look, I took some of the confetti that I bought at Hobby Lobby and stuck it onto the ball with double-sided tape. I love double-sided tape. It serves so many uses when you're crafting and it makes things so easy. You don't have to deal with messy glue and you can also remove things if you ever want to. I love how this turned out. When you turn it, it just sparkles in the light. So next, these party horns were from Dollar Tree and I'm gonna take these apart and embellish them and make them extra special. Now they were fine just the way they were and you could use them and it'd be no problem, but I wanted to take it up a notch. So we're gonna take off the original fringe and just be thorough, make sure you get all of that tape off. And then I found these bows at Dollar Tree and I thought they were so pretty and so festive. And of course the silver color goes with our tablescape colors. So what you wanna do is just take those bows apart then we're gonna carefully take the paper backing off, but make sure that you leave the staple intact. We want all that ribbon to stay stapled together. So next, I'm gonna take out that double stick tape again, and I'm gonna wrap it around the end of our party horn. Now try to get this as neat as possible, just so you have a really nice, clean look. Then we're gonna wrap the ribbon around the end of the horn. And as you do this, just make sure that you get it lined up and as neat as possible and press that on there very firmly so that your ribbon won't fall off. And you can see that I've done that here. This is the confetti that we used earlier and it was also from Hobby Lobby. These pretty iridescent glasses were from Home Goods. These metallic sheets, they're 12 by 12, they were from Hobby Lobby. And often you can find those on sale for half price. These are silver flatware from Dollar Tree and I bought enough for four place settings. I got this black tablecloth from Amazon. It was pretty affordable and there are tons of different ones on there so you can choose pretty much any one that you like. I'm gonna start by placing my centerpiece in the middle of the table, and then I'm gonna place all of my other items around the centerpiece. And that's a really great way to start if you're not exactly sure how to start. So you'll see that I'm being sure to sprinkle the confetti on both sides of the table because you have to remember that a tablescape is most often gonna be seen from both sides. So you need to make sure that you have balance on both of those sides of the table. So I've placed these pink balls on both sides of the table and distributed them nicely. I put silver metallic straws that were from Target in my glasses, and then I'm gonna go ahead and light my candle here. These candles were on clearance from Crate and Barrel that I got a while ago, actually. I like to pick up things like that when they're on clearance, especially at stores that might be a little bit more on the pricey side. It's a good way to get better quality items. Take a moment to like, share, comment, and subscribe, and hit the notification button for more great content. Happy New Year.